I have just spawned in this herd of 17 spinal sources, and I am going to make them take on this herd of 30 rockiosauruses. Hello everyone, I'm the Lando Game and welcome back to another epic dinosaur battle video. We are here again in the epic race map where we have 17 spinos going to take on a herd of 30 brachiosauruses. Now the spinos, there are 16 of them, 8 blue, 8 this color, in regular base form, meaning their health and attack are not modified. And we have one huge orange guy here who has 4 times attack and 4 times attack. How do you think he'll do? Let me know below in the comments section and without further ado, let's begin. Under off. Ready to take on the first wave of Brachiosaurus, this lone one here. And if you look around the way, you'll notice there are small hoods. For example, here is a hood of 5 Brachiosaurus and here is a hood of 3 of them. So there are small hoods like these scattered throughout the map and towards the end. That's the big hood because in the back, this is the elder Brachiosaurus. You can tell by the size difference. Basically twice the size of a regular Brachiosaurus like this guy here. And he has two guards on the left and on the right. Anyway, back to, well, the fight. We have the Elder Spinal taking the first attack and killing the first Brachiosaurus. He has lost some health, but nothing major. And we have a, a traffic jam here where we have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 Spinals knocked down on the floor. And a few here knocked down and severely injured, which is rather unfortunate. Anyway, this is the second Brachiosaurus to be engaged in battle. He is taken out very easily. Now we have the third one. Let's go do the running up. Smaller one is going to be the first contact. Saving the bigger if the larger bulk looks like. And he still hasn't run it yet, but the smaller guys are doing some significant damage. Pushing the Brachiosaurus can't really attack multiple at once. As just multiple spinos at once, so doing pretty okay. And these spinos here are caught up again, but they should make it around. We have three paralyzed spinos versus, which is unfortunate, but we still have over 10 left, so that's pretty okay. And that's a big spine who just fell down and doesn't look like he's gonna get back up anytime soon, not gonna lie. And that'll be a severe hindrance to the spinos completing this valuable wave battle. And looks like we're about to lose our first Spinosaurus to an attack. And we lost one Spinosaurus to that attack on the Brachiosaurus, but we have a herd of around 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, or 8 going on, charging full speed ahead, ready to battle. And do we have these two? Yep, we have these two more guys charging full speed ahead, and the elder one who is unfortunately stuck. I can try to make him move, but as you can see, he isn't going anywhere. I can try to push him, but that's not gonna work, so let's check back in on our group of spinos. Attacking the sixth Brachiosaurus, I believe. And we have another one which unfortunately fell down. He gets back up and dies to the fall damage. And this other one is on basically zero health. Again, very unfortunate. And that's another Brachiosaurus which bites dust onto the last one before they have to climb this massive ramp to get to the hood of five Brachiosauruses. Because of course they are guarded by this lone one at the right here at the top of the hill. And finally these two guys have made it to the battle. Running on full speed ahead, that's the elder one who unfortunately is well totally out of the battle. Wish he could still be in it and now we are climbing the great hill. And this is a place where most dinosaurs tend to die from fall damage or from just falling down and can't get them back up, i.e. becoming paralyzed. And now, from a huge number of 8, looks like we only have 4 Spinosaurus still in the battle. We may have 1 coming along to make it 5, but that's really not a lot, especially when we have these guys on basically zero health but they're about to attack this one Brachiosaurus he's a lone one they caught them by the neck so they can deal extra damage so he should not be much of a problem 
and that one just got killed to the fall damage. We have three in the battle and one coming up who just fell down. Um, they do manage to kill the Brachiosaurus, but now there's a hood of five. Only three guys here and one well, coming up the rear. Let's see how he's gonna do and... This looks like a bit scaled up Brachia's sources actually. They were slightly stronger than the regular tanks. And we lost another Spino. Another one's just one left. Luckily the other four haven't engaged in battle so it's a 1v1. And from the looks of it... Looks like this Brachia search may take out all three Spinosaurus. We have one slowly coming up. Hopefully he can help his friend before he dies, but it doesn't look like that will happen. And that three Brachiosaurus take three Spinosaurus take out by this one Brachiosaurus. One more Spino, the last one coming in to attack and two Brachiosaurus have engaged. Kicking him using their full body weight, just rocked all him around, totally manhandling him, and they have successfully killed every major Spinosaurus. Let's see, can we get them to come down here? Hopefully, not really. But anyway, there's no way these guys would have taken out every single Brachiosaurus, even with a full squad. Maybe the elder would have. Maybe the Elder would have carried them most of the way, but I highly doubt it. Anyway, that's it for today's video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please consider leaving a like, subscribing, and until next time, I will see you later. So, bye for now.